It's debate night, but we're not in Milwaukee. Mr. President, thanks for joining us. Thank you. Why are you at the Fox News debate tonight in Milwaukee? Well, you know, a lot of people have been asking me that, and many people said you shouldn't do them, but you see the polls have come out, and I'm leading by 50 and 60 points. And, you know, some of them are at one and zero and uh, two. And I'm saying, do I sit there for an hour or two hours, whatever it's going to be, and uh, get harassed by people that shouldn't even be running for president? Should I be doing that? Uh, and a network that isn't particularly friendly to me, frankly. You know, they, uh, they were back in Ronda Sanctimonious like crazy, and now they've given up on him. I mean, he's, it's a lost cause. It reminded me very much of 2016. You know, in 2016, I went through the same stuff and had to fight them all the way, and then they became very friendly after I won, or just about when I was winning. But I just felt it would be uh, more appropriate not to do the debate. I don't think it's uh, right to do it. Uh, if you're leading by 50, 60, I have one poll, I'm leading by 70 points, and I'm saying, why am I doing it? And I'm going to have eight people, 10 people, whoever made the debate, I don't know how many it is, but I'm going to have all these people screaming at me, shouting questions at me, all of which I love answering, I love doing, but it doesn't make sense to do them. So uh, I've taken a pass, as it's, you probably noticed. Oh, I, I did. <laughs> I'm grateful that you did. I got indicted four times. All trivia, nonsense, bull****. It's all bull****. It's horrible when you look and, and you look at what they're doing.